She's in the house! We grew up in Salinas with a culture of giving back, and I think that stems as I think about it, from the nature of the old agricultural industry, which is boom and bust. In some years, they'd lose a ton of money. Some years, they'd make a ton of money. When they made a ton of money, they'd be very generous. They would give it to various civic organizations or projects or buildings, that kind of thing. So when they had the money, they gave it. It just generated this culture of, of philanthropy in, in Salinas, I think. And if you look at various communities around the country, people cite Salinas as being different. Uh, because of the culture of the people. We've embraced that. My grandfather and our family kind of led the charge there by helping build the, the local hospital. Uh, he donated the land and helped raise the money uh, to get that done. And so that's been part of the Taylor family program you know, since for the last 80 years. We've embraced that system-wide. So every plant has an opportunity to give back. And it's not just money, right? It's not just providing money to a project. It's providing your time and your talent. And so we have people that are giving blood once a month, I mean, every month. We have people that are donating time to their churches or to their schools or to local parks or to the, very, the charities that they like. And so it's a way for us to help build community internally, but also celebrate what we've been able to achieve with others in the community.